Hey everyone, Eric here and also Otis. In this video, we're checking out the La Bruja from Pure Salem Guitars. As I said in the intro, this is the La Bruja from Pure Salem Guitars. And Pure Salem Guitars, if you're not familiar, are a guitar company that's located in Florida, run by a guy named Rick Sell. And there's a lot to love about Pure Salem Guitars. First and foremost, look at this shape. Rick said he wanted to do something kind of like a Firebird or Thunderbird and kind of like pointy and offset. So I think he nailed it. So this is an original shape and it's full of appointments that are very well executed. Let's go over some specs. We have two humbuckers and they have gold basket weave coverings. We have a mahogany body and a mahogany neck with a rosewood fretboard. We've got a bound neck and block inlays. It looks incredibly classy. I love block inlays. And we have like top of the line Tone Pros hardware. So we've got a Tone Pros bridge and tailpiece right here. One of the things that I've fallen in love with, this is the first guitar I've used with locking tuners. You know, I gotta say, I kind of want to put them on a bunch of my other guitars because it's so convenient and so, it just works so well. And then our electronics are very simple. We've got a three-way toggle right here to change between the pickups and we have a volume and tone. Let's go ahead and just hear what this guitar is about. So here's the neck pickup. <laughs> Here's the bridge pickup. And then here are both pickups together. So as you can hear, the pickups, they sound great. They sound full. They have articulation. They look great. And as we're talking, you know, all of these specs don't mean anything if they are not going to a guitar that's appealing to you, is comfortable to play, and sounds good. And the La Bruja, to me, nails all of those. The frets up the neck are not pokey. As you're sliding up the neck, your fingers glide over them instead of catching on them, either on the edge of the fretboard or on the bevel. Let's move on from some clean sounds, turn the reverb up on my amp and hear how that sounds. So now I turn the reverb almost all the way up on the Boss Katana. We're just going from the guitar into the amp. That was both pickups. Let's check out the neck. And then of course the bridge. So if you're anything like me, that's probably enough clean sound for you. So let's go ahead and get fuzzy. I've got the Does It Doom Doom Saw, which is like an HM2 style pedal. Let's kick that on, hear how it sounds. It's probably gonna sound crazy. <laughs>
I think that sounds cool. <laughs> and speaking of fuzzy goodness, let's go ahead and run the La Bruja into the Fuzz Imp Shroot and Adventure. And so kind of opposite of that, let's go ahead and run into a delay. I'm using the memory toy from Electro Harmonics. And then we're gonna run into a reverb, the Dark World from Chase Bliss Audio. So that's the La Bruja from Pure Salem Guitars. I hope you dug this video. I would love to know if you dig this shape and also like what kind of music would you play on this guitar? Because again, it's very unique and it's not really catered towards like one style of playing versus another. So let me know that in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching. If you'd like to help support the channel, I do have a Patreon. I'll leave a link in the description below. I'll also leave a link to the Pure Salem Guitars website in the description below too, so you can go there and check out all of the cool guitars like this one and a bunch of other ones. So again, thank you so much for watching. I hope you're doing well. I hope you're staying safe and I hope you're taking care of yourself out there. I'll talk to you in the next video.